Tonight, a family mourns the unexpected loss of their son. 17 year old Trent Wheat was a high school baseball player at Newburn High School. His family says the senior passed away on June 16th from complications from sepsis. As you can imagine, the news has rocked the Newburn High community, especially the Bears baseball program. Our Jalen Holloway sat down with the Wheat's family and former head coach earlier today to reflect on Wheat's memory. He's live in studio with more. Jalen. Well, Derek, many say playing on the diamond was Trent Wheat's true passion. Now, in fact, his family says he was not the average teen, but say it was always evident early on in his life that the 17 year old would be someone who his peers admired, but say his passing showed them just how many lives he touched in Bear Country. To his mom, Leslie, 17 year old Trent Wheat came off a little introverted, but whenever it came to baseball, he was the life of the party. He was everything. He was uh, everybody's friend. But last Friday, the family says that light was dim. Wheat passed away from sepsis complications. His mother says she wouldn't want to wish the pain of losing a child on any parent. It's not easy at all. And the people that I have talked to have been phenomenal. So, and um, my support system throughout the community has been phenomenal. Leslie says New Bern High School has shown immense support during their family's grief especially Trent's former baseball coach, Michael Ellsworth. I enjoyed having Trent. He was obviously um, very young uh, when he came into the program, but also showed a lot of uh, maturity in a lot of different areas. Trent's brother, Ethan, says Trent's love for the diamond was obvious when they were little kids. We both started playing baseball for years, and I stopped, but uh, he, he, he wanted to keep going. He loved it. And he, he loved pitching, he loved, he loved the baseball lifestyle. He had, it was like he had another whole family. Yes, Trent's family may have loved watching their shortstop steal bases here at Boykin Field, but they believe he'll be remembered most for how he lived life on his terms. He was ready to expand and fly. He was, he was just ready to see the world. And I think that's what everybody has to remember is just, you, gotta, you just gotta live your life no matter what. Now, as I mentioned earlier, Trent was preparing to hit his upcoming senior year out the park. And although he isn't here anymore to physically do that, Coach Ellsworth and his family believe his classmates will finish the job in his memory. Glad to see this family staying strong there, Derek, despite the situation. Absolutely. Certainly a, uh, a true testament to his memory there, Jalen. Thank you so much. Trent Wheat's family also started a GoFundMe page for people to donate as well. Thank, that link will be on our website, WITN.com.